Alright, so it's been a while and once again I made a video and I fucked up the audio, nothing recorded. So I have to do a voiceover again using my phone, watching this video. Anyway, today I want to talk about garage settings and limiting the gears and limiting the options in the gear and differential selection. You ask why would you want to do that? Just to keep things realistic and kind of simulate the stock transmissions and, and ratios that the car came with. Right here we know that 1961 Corvette came with a 3 and 4 speed transmission, manual options and automatic transmission only had uh, the first two slowest engines to work with but for now the top three engines did not get the automatic transmission so we're gonna do manual for now and as you can see the gear ratios for the trainees are two and three speed transmission and the differential ratios i put in the bottom um it's all done using these lines right here in the garage settings of the exe csv file you see first second third fourth gear and so on so is the differential if you look, minimum and maximum is the range of values. Basically, each number is a spot with a specific gear ratio equals to one click of the mouse. So, original values from 0 to 34. That means we have 34 clicks of adjustment. And as you can see, I limited on the first gear. Now we only have gears from 7 to 11. And the next value right there, where it says step, that's how many clicks you skip how many places you skip with each click. Basically, I told it to skip four clicks. So if we start at seven, the next click is gonna bring us to 11, and these are gonna be the only two gear options available. So basically, same thing would be with the second gear. You see how it is locked from 22 to 26 at the step of four? That means that we start from the field number 22 and it's going to give us a gear ratio and then one click will bring us to field number 26 and those are going to be the only ratios available. Here let me move the game a little bit to the right and uh, let's take a look at how it works. On the left you see the gear ratios for the first gear 3 speed transmission is 247 and for the 4 speed transmission is 2.2. And as you can see, these are the two ratios only available for the first gear. And how I've done it, I limited it from 7 to 11 at the step of 4. Now, second gear, as you can see for the 4 speed train, is 166. So we spot on the money on that one. And on the 3 speed transmission, the second gear is 152. And we're going to be spot on the money with that value as well. You're going to see in the middle. I will actually have to leave you for a little bit because I have a friend of mine visiting. Let me just finish showing you the gears. As you can see, third gear is set as one to one, but the other click is gonna unlock it for one more step, and that's 131. You can see how that lines up with the four gear ratio, and the fourth speed transmission obviously has a four gear set at one to one, while the three speed transmission not gonna have. So the way you set up the transmissions, you just click away like this, 242, 152, 1.0, and you got yourself 3-speed transmission gear ratios, you just don't shift into 4, and that's how you go about it. But here you have a 3-speed transmission setup with the realistic historical gears, the way they're supposed to be. And then if you want to change that to 4-speed transmission, you just click away the numbers to 2.2. 166, 131, and then leave the fourth one as 1.0, and you got yourself a four speed transmission accurate, Sp spot on with the values that came in 1961 with the Corvette transmission four speed manual or three speed manual. This is how I locked it, and this is a pretty clever, tr clever trick to keep it kind of realistic in a way. Uh, same thing with the differentials because we cannot adjust the exact fields for the differential the lowest one is not 336 but 341 as you can see on the diff ratio but right there from 111 to 129 we have four spots at the steps of six so it's going to be 111 117 123 and 129 those are going to be the four spots for the gifts 
that are unlocked and we skip six spots right there step of six each time we click and as you can see right there we have one two three four differential options that the manual trainings came with right there 336 37 411 and 456 we cannot adjust exact numbers so we just dial it as close as we can at 3.5 413 375 and so on but let me just go and stop lagging my body and i'll get back with you guys for the second part of this video all right and i'm back to finish this dying video four hours later i don't really know what i'm showing you oh the differential okay same thing with the differential we lock the steps and the fields that are available uh, down to only four options as close as we could get without editing the actual gear ratios now steps off i wish i could see in this goddamn video right now because i'm totally lost doing this whole voiceover thing once again whatever let's just go with it anyway we're in the garage minimum maximum trick and the steps that we use to and the one click how many steps fuels is it gonna skip yeah i don't know if i'm confusing you or not but by using a simple technique you could eliminate the number of gears available in the garage and the number of differential ratios available not only that you could actually structure them to see uh, where you could have a few of them yet they're still be limited as close to real as it gets right there you can see me flipping through the differential and it goes from 458 instead of 456 or because this is as close as we can get and then 411 in real life versus 413 in SP 2003 this is as close as it gets and yari 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 i'm not gonna go too much detail this is the five engine option power level available that we're gonna make from 195 to 270 horsepower special camshaft and that's the one that I'm messing around with right now, testing the three and four speed transmissions. Let me go on the track for just a little bit and show you how it's all gonna look like. I don't know if I'm running the three or four speed training. Also the red line, red limit is not set to 65, 66. Transmission is coming through. 